Donald Trump, do you think a businessman like Trump has a chance to be president? Do you think he has any shot at all? Do you think this is real? Um, no, just because no one would work with him. Like, Republicans <laughs> and Democrats would be babies, and they would pout because they're, like, bought and owned. And it's like, how come this guy's free right. and gets to say whatever he wants? I mean, I don't know. I've enjoyed the hell out of him, just all the stuff the guy's been saying. I, just, I hope more politicians are just at least just say what they're thinking. Right. I love when they were going like, yeah, you, you, you said all this sexist stuff about women. You said this about women. You said that about women. You said this. And he goes, no, no, no. I said that about Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> <laughs> and then they laughed. And then they're like, no, no, no. You said it about other women, too. And he goes, yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> and then it was just over. That's all you got to do is just admit, yeah, that's what I do. You know, I have a, every once in a while, I have a couple shots of bourbon. I go off on the broads. And then, you know. I get back down to business. <laughs> it what is I true. Do. It is crazy. Like, yeah. so many people spend all their time in the media apologizing and explaining, and he just, if people that just say, yeah, that's what I did, they seem to get away with it. Yeah, that's what you do. I think comics should do that. When people get, like, annoyed and they go into your Twitter account from 10 years ago, mm -hmm. and they're like, oh, you said this about, you know, whatever, Saved by the Bell in 1988. <laughs> I want an apology. It's like, all right, well, get in the time machine and talk to me back then. Yeah. You, so you think uh, politicians should let their, their human side come out? Yeah, absolutely. I absolutely do. But I mean, I don't think it matters who's president. I'm one of those people. I don't what? think it does. You don't I don't think, think it matters. matters. It doesn't. Doesn't. Doesn't matter at all. Dude, Hillary Clinton goes to those Bilderberg meetings. That's like the Illuminati stuff, right? She probably hooked up with some guy wearing like a goat's head, and then she goes out on TV. And she's talking to people who drive snow plows, like she can relate to them. That's why, that's why I like Republicans better than Democrats, because they just, they, I, I know they don't like me. I know that they don't want me in their neighborhood. They're pushing people with wheelchairs down the stairs. Get out of here! God made this for me! All of you, beat it! So they're being honest, you think? Yo, no, I mean, I don't think any of them are honest. Like, oh. look, I'll say this, though. Like, just the stuff that they focus on. You know what I mean? There's a guy from Nestle that doesn't think water is a human right. I mean, that guy should be hunt down and shot. Yeah. Right? And they're going to sit and just talk about it. Talking about all the... Uh, I don't know what they're talking about. Yeah, we got to get America back to work. We gotta, it's like, dude, this guy wants to own the rain. Can, can we do something about this guy? He works at Nestle. You're supposed to be happy. Like making cocoa for people. And this guy's like going, well, people are running out of water. What if we owned all the water and we kept it under our place? And in the future, when everybody's... That's how you picture the guy talking. I want to own the water. I want to have it underneath my house. And just, I'll, come to a, I'll come to the door in a robe, slightly adjust. Right? <laughs> it's a complete animal. Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to see even more great Conan clips. You may now return to your pirated movies and creepy Japanese pornography.